Green at Drexel Heritage of South Lake and only South Lake. Well, he's known as the Iceman. He's the current uh, UFC light heavyweight champion with a background in martial arts, kickboxing, college wrestling, San Luis Obispo. I know that place. But when he's not fighting Randy Couture or Tito Ortiz, the ultimate fighting championship arena, he's talking movies today. Chuck Liddell is in Dallas to promote a wild and violent new film based on Frank Miller's graphic novel opening next week. It's called 300. Saw it yesterday. And it is wild. Everyone say hello to ultimate fight champion Chuck Liddell. Nice to see you, Chuck. Well, nice Good see you. to see you. Nice Welcome to Dallas. Time. You've been to Dallas much before? I've been here quite a few times, yeah. Okay. I want to talk about ultimate fight championships because that's something that most of us will never, ever experience in our lives. We, none of us, most of us walking around the planet have the chops of what it takes to get in the ring and do that. How long have you been doing this, and how would you get started in this? I was 12. Yeah? I was a comfy theater, and then, uh, then Deb was in between, the, in between the clips. Right. And I really got interested in the clips and started teaching our books, and my mom got me in a crying class. Yeah, and so you, but when, remember the first time you stepped in the ring to fight like this? Because it's different than college wrestling. Oh, yeah, it's a little different. It? It's a little louder, a little, a little, a little stressing. Okay, uh, the movie 300, you've seen it, and you're out to promote the film right now, right? You okay, Chuck? Yeah, I'm okay. All right? You all right? All right. Doing all right. Okay. Uh, have you seen the, the movie 300? I saw it, yeah. I saw it a few times, actually. I actually... Uh, last night I saw it on, on IMAX. It was, yeah. it was amazing. I've never, well, watched, stuff. I've never watched IMAX, so right. it was really, really exciting on IMAX. Well, for, for, yeah, IMAX is a whole lot better. And in fact, most movies are a whole lot better in IMAX. But when I watched this movie, which is basically about the Spartans, which is 400 B.C., I mean, these guys all fought like crazy. They're real guys that really did exist. I know they fought in the nude back then in the day, you know, in the movie they don't do that, but they were kind of the ultimate fighting machine, which is probably yeah, the connection and, and with why you were on tour talking about this movie. Well, and they had no fear of fighting. They, they fought for what they believed in, and they, I think at all times they thought they could win, but they were also willing to give up their life to win what they thought they should win. When you, when you get in a ring, and I, I, don't, I don't want to, you know, tie everything into the movie here, but when you get in the ring and you fight, there's, there's no way... I mean, is there a point where you, you don't really give up? I mean, you either get beat. You either get beat, that's the, my sport, or, or, or you give up. But, right. I mean, for the most part, the tough guys out there, the, they've got to get beat in this sport. They're not going to let that someone, you know, uh, put them out with just one low, low or right. one situation. Now, when do you fight next, Chuck? Probably the end of May. That's what we're working on. Do you know who you're going to fight? Who do you want to fight? Um, Bernard White, I wouldn't mind fighting. I uh, wouldn't mind fighting uh, uh, Tommy Morrison. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, because he's um, back. Wow. There's quite a few guys out there I wouldn't mind, wouldn't mind getting there and throwing punches with. Well, hang in there. May the force be with you. All right. The movie 300, based on Frank Miller's graphic novel starring Gerard Butler from Phantom of the Opera, actually opens in Texas theaters on Friday, the March the 9th. And you hang in there today, okay? Take care of yourself. Thank you very much, man. All right, sir. Right. Hang in there. Brenda? I'm working on it. All right. Well, when we come back, Craig Lewin from Busy Body Fitness shows us how a machine is going to help lessen the pressure on our joints. It's